position, fifth and six. Oh, Barber gets a big push in the middle of one. Oh, three, four. Oh, that Barber's been sent round by Waldo. So that Barber got up the inside there of the 11 car. Oh. He's got drums, he's going to get it off. And now he's pulled down in front of Doody. And Doody just slaps him in the left front, breaks the front out, he slaps Cook. And we've got a bit of drama as in turn number one. We're going to need the Butterbeek towing service hook truck, I think, for the 73, the front end is. We have to jump, he'll slide up into first place early, but now here comes Brendan Doyle looking up the inside through turns number two. And a container and around goes Rosa. Yellow lights will come on. It's on to third now as Curry and Fletcher go side by side. Oh, and Smith goes round. Curry gets a shot in the back for freeze troubles. And I think we might just get a little bit of a speaking to. Morgan, bit of a cork in the bottle now. He's holding up the bit of the field. Teresi is looking to the high side. Rigby now looks to the inside of Teresi. Oh, they get bottlenecked. Around they go. Stuart looks straight on the inside into turn number three. Looking, looking, looking. Slides up, gives a bit of a touch to Menzies. Gets all out of shape. Menzies tries to recover, gets stuck on the inside burn and goes round. Now on the inside. They're side by side, they're two by two. Oh, Parker in the back of Dooney. Cook in the back of Parker, there's a car pull up. Oh! There was four or five cars involved in that, and I tell you what, at one stage, that could have been a massive, massive accident. The road and gone. Spence in second spot with Bayfield on the outside of Montgomery. They're coming to contact. Montgomery fights back. Puts Bayfield up towards the wall. Oh, in heavy contact. And Stewart makes contact with the right rear, and I hope everyone's A-OK. -okay. That was heavy contact between the Montgomery car and Stewart. Well, I want to be, and find himself up in the third. Now he's challenging Little Hales in the second. Look how much grip is upstairs. Oh, and we put the curse on him. He's come barreling into the infield and I think he's broken the drive shaft on the right hand side of the 31. Side by side, Brims gets the better of the start. Peel needs to beat Richters. It's as simple as that. Oh! Oh! oh over. We've got a big crash. Oh! Multi rollover. Is that... Brady Rust has gone over about five times. BWR Machinery Productions and MP Terrace is here! A great start from everyone again, especially Richard Cork. He moves to that outside once more. Roberts gets a better start. We're three wide through turn two. Cork on the outside. Oh, we've got two in the fence. And Bell and looks like the 20 out of Duke. They make contact. We go back to our leaders. Roberts in half. Oh, heavy oh. contact. This is going to be a disaster now. Everyone gets on the brakes. Je Stoddy is off the racetrack. Adrian Stott was on the go-kart track. Josh Harmon's going to hit the wall again. The front end's completely fallen out, the number 11. And I've seen some things in St. Anne Racing, Graham, but I've never, veering into the concrete, and uh, broke the front end, and he had nowhere to go. He was boxed in on all sides. And uh, I tell you what, I think Harm might be, yeah, a little bit disappointed there with the 22 car. Yeah, Roberts did push him up towards the fence a little. Face to face down the back straight away. Cook swaps to the bottom, tries to get by Frank Packer. That's one of the cars he's battling with for this video art machinery championship. Oh, Nick Cook gets turned around by Jarius. Is he going to stay racing? The lights are green at the moment. Rose and Black is side by side in the back straight away. We all wide the wall over the back straight. Black keep going. Oh, Prince has gone around in the middle of the field. And around goes Randall and they all somehow avoid it. Well, once again, that was very lucky, but it got to be a more serious incident.